Joining us now is Teresa Geraldes. She is a member of the Committee for Professional Opportunities for Women. She's also an active member of the society. Teresa, thank you so much for joining us. Uh, talk to us about the importance for young researchers to really get involved with the biophysical society. Well, I think that as a scientist, we are in our labs, we are close there, but we are part of a community. And I think that this society provides precisely uh, an open field to actually meet with everyone, learn from the experience of, of uh, the elder and provide support for the young scientists, younger than, than us. And, and I think that, that the society is fantastic in that, in that sense. And Teresa, it also opens up young scientists to other fields of research, not this, their own specific field of research. Talk to us about that. Yes, that is true. I think that we come here from a certain area of research and we benefit greatly in, from that, but we are also exposed to other areas that are close and science is more and more multidisciplinary these days. And so coming to this meeting and joining this society provides access to, to that multidisciplinarity. And how important is it for a young researcher's growth to become a member of the Biophysical Society? Well, as I said, I think that it is very important to learn not only science, which is very important and crucial here. Uh, coming here every year puts you in the cutting edge of, of any area in biophysics. And for people like me, who lives in other countries, smaller countries, it's fundamental. Uh, so I think that being a member of this society is just a warranty of, of growing. And how has it helped you personally? You, you've had a very rich relationship and membership with the society. Talk to us about that. Well, I, was, I first was a member of the society in 2002 here in San Francisco. It was, was my first meeting. And um, I've learned so much. And I'm especially grateful for, to the society because uh, in 2009 they, they gave me the Margaret Oakley Dayhoff Award. Um, and uh, I think that that made a huge difference in, in my career. It was a turning point and I'm really grateful for, for that. So if one wants to get involved and really get engaged with the society, how easy is it and what should they do to get started? Well, it is very easy. I think that it's just a matter of, of willing. Um, I think that being a member of the society uh, after you're a member of the society, then uh, the committees are online, the applications are online. You just need to write and, and, and say that you want to be part of it. And in that sense, I have to say that the, the society and the committees are really welcoming. And they really appreciate the, the, uh, us wanting to help. And that's, at least this is what I've experienced. So it takes time, it takes time. I think that, uh, of course, it takes time from the science. We all are here to be immersed in, in, in what we really like and love, but it is really rewarding. I think you said it right there, Teresa. Very easy process, but very worthwhile. Thank you so much for joining us, Teresa. Thank you.